here and welcome to my channel. Today I'm in my foyer. On my last video, I told y'all I uh, couldn't show y'all this side of the wall. I was focusing more attention on that side because we're going to be hanging up some new wall decor on this side. I have been talking about getting something new on this wall for a good while now. I have had a silver mirror put up. I had a gold hammered mirror in this spot. Well, it just didn't fit right the size. Now, I almost felt like Goldilocks when I went out looking for something else. Like, it was too big. It was too small. It wasn't this. It wasn't that. I finally found something that's size appropriate. I think it's going to fit perfectly on this wall. The reason I wouldn't show y'all much of this side on the wall because I had just freshly painted. Well, actually, I putty and paint. I had some nail holes here that I wanted to, you know, go ahead and get rid of them before I hung up anything new. So, I didn't really want to show y'all, you know, a naked wall. So, that's why I kind of kept y'all's attention on this side. <laughs> anyway, um, I have been searching and searching, looking for something that was size appropriate for this space. And then I think I finally found it. I went on Amazon looking at mirrors and I and I, found, I come across this one mirror. And I, the reason why I really liked it, it was something unique about it. So, I thought, you know what? I'm going to give it a shot. I ordered it. It came. It's been here for months. But being sick, you know, I really couldn't film a lot. So finally, I am going to get this mirror hung up. And I found something else I'm going to hang above it. I think it's going to be perfect for this area. So let me go ahead and uh, get my ladder, kind of size up where I want my mirror to hang because I do have a stand below it. So I, want, I, I won't, don't want it too low. And of course, I don't want it too high. So let me go ahead and um, get my measurements and go ahead and hang it up. Then I will show y'all this mirror, okay? Hang on. All right, you all, I got it hung up. So let me show y'all my new mirror. And there you go. Let me take you off the tripod and I will show you what it looks like. All right, and here she is. Okay, now you see what it is I love about her. It's got a nautical feel about it. Uh, it's got this rope um, tied on each side of these little clips here. I'm gonna go around this side over here and I'll show y'all that side. It's right there. And it is suspended by this other little, see it's got that little attachment there. You hang that up first and they, the jeep string uh, or nautical string kind of suspends in the air from it. And so there it is. What do y'all think? Do y'all like this mirror better? I am very, very happy with it. Sorry about the shadow. Um, my ring light's giving a shadow in here. Sorry about that. But anyway, there is my mirror. I am very, very tickled for it. I think the size is so appropriate. Because down here, that's where I would have my other cabinet below it. And I had a measure about how far it, I wanted. I need to take my little... Pen, uh, pencil marks off, but there is the bottom. That's where down this area right here is where the cabinet would be. Okay, it's got a bronzy um, color to it, and I think with all the other colors I got in my home, I think it matches perfectly. And I love the the jeep rope here. Very very nice. Um, hubby is going to go back. He said later and take it down and kind of make sure that these are tied really good and tight for me, just to make sure. But there is that. I love those ropes. Absolutely gorgeous. I mean, you got a nautical um, vibe going in your home. This mirror is perfect. I will make sure I, you know, I link this mirror in the uh, description box below. So just in case y'all are interested in it. But the mirror is, I'm so happy. So, so happy. All right, so let me get you back on the tripod and I'll be right back. Okay, so at first I thought, you know what, it's perfect. I love it. But I, I kind of looked above and I thought, you know what, I wouldn't mind adding some garland to the top or something. It just, something was, uh, it just like it was naked up there. And I thought, is there anything else I got I can put up there beside garland? You know, and I thought, I'll give it a, you know, a little extra. Well, so I was at Michael's the other day. And I come across this. It looks like this here. I'm going to cut it back up a little bit. Home, sweet home. And look, y'all, it's got like a concave curve to it. And look, heavy distressing to it. Love it. And now this here, I, yeah, this is my vibe I've got going on in my home. Now, 
Um, on the back, it does show $44.99. Y'all know I didn't pay that. They had all their decor, 50% off, so I paid $20, well, $22 for it. And I thought, okay, I can I can do that. It's worth that. Um, and, it, and it's got, you can either hang it up by this one hook or all three, like one's here and then um, one's at this end, whatever you want to do, you know. But And I thought by putting that right above that little knob there, I thought that is what it needed. So let me get my ladder back up. Let me hang this sign and let's see what we got. Okay, hang on. Oh my goodness, I love it. Let me take y'all and spin y'all around. Let me show y'all a little up close. Okay, let me get y'all a little bit closer here. And there you go. What do y'all think? I like it. And then I can always throw some garland up here to, you know, jazz it up. Especially Christmas is coming. You know, I may put something up top up there. Maybe some Christmas garland or something. Kind of jazz it up a little bit. But I really love the color combos of this. I love the nautical rope along with that. The stressing of the sign is fits perfectly. See what I was saying? I think it needed a little something something at the top of where that little knob is for the rope. And also, no, it goes well with that sign as well. I got it very top of the door. Yeah. So now I'm going to put y'all back on the tripod and I'm going to go ahead and put the cabinet that goes below the mirror and then we'll kind of decorate that up a little bit. And then I think this video is going to be about it. And uh, that, way, that way this one project is going to be done. I don't know about a hack. I always use a little magic eraser. If you got a little scuff mark on your walls or whatever, always have one right beside of it when you're doing any kind of redecorate anything because you will always have a little scuff mark. And you take it, don't scrub too hard. You want to take your paint off. Now it'll dry here a little bit and it'll be just perfect. Okay, now this is my cabinet. I've had it here for a while, but I'm gonna go put kind of put the same stuff I had up on it already, my fall items, and then here I will start taking it down and adding some Christmas. So I don't wanna throw up too much um, fall here or put everything back fall, but uh, cause we'll be taking it down here in, in a week, but I do wanna go ahead and put something on here, so. Let me first start out. I got this uh, Buffalo Check Runner. And we're gonna put it right here. Next thing I'll put up, I got my little pumpkin right here. Um, I got it on a, a timer, um, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and keep it here. So we are going to plug her in. Okay. Right there in the middle, of course, for now. Next up, I've got um, this beige is some florals that I picked up off of Amazon. And actually it's one of those TikTok maybe buy it kind of things. These here, uh, somebody showed them on, on their TikTok and I loved them. Oh, nice. There's two, um, excuse me, three of them. One, no, two stems. I apologize. Just two stems. And I kind of bent it and kind of put them in there. And I think it really looks nice. I'm going to put it on this side of the mirror. course for now until you know we start decorating for Christmas so um, I'm gonna leave that right there I probably put that back on there when um, after Christmas because I really like the way this all looks with the greenery in it okay next up now on this side of my pumpkin 
I'm going to put up a couple candlesticks. Um, I got these from at home. I've had them for a while. We're going to put these guys right here. And maybe you might look at them. Put, we got to put some of these candlesticks and <laughs> we're going to put our squirrels. These are some squirrels that I bought from Hobby Lobby this year. Um, I'm going to put these guys back on here because, you know, just put them on there for, just for staging sake, you know. Have y'all seen these guys? These were so cute. Look at them. I got one um, standing up and, of course, one sitting down. I'm going to put the one like that. And then one, well, let me see how it looks. Let me try it differently. Nope. Okay, put you up here. And put you down there. That's perfect. I get now last little thing. I got a couple of signs and pumpkins. Okay, we need something right here in front of this little vase. And I got this little sign. It says Pump, uh, "Happy Pumpkin Spice Season." Really cute, and it's like um, it's got like stands like that. So we're gonna put it right there in front of that vase. That looks really cute there. And then I need something right here. Oh, I think I'm gonna get some pumpkins. Let me go get some pumpkin. Okay. All right, let me see. I'm gonna put some black and white pumpkins. Just kind of play around with it. You know, just kind of scatter them right there. And I think that's it. Yep, I think that's all I wanna put on here because again, we're gonna be taking this all down and you know, for Christmas. So I'm just gonna put some things, I, already, I know I already have these here. Y'all probably had a sneak peek of my squirrels on my uh, video. So. Um, I think I'm done with this, so let me go ahead and bring the camera closer and let y'all see what I've done, so hang on. video but I did want to get this thing hung up and I couldn't wait to you know any longer I want to go ahead and get this mirror hung up and see how it's gonna look and I think it is the perfect mirror for this little area. All right, you all well, I am very 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 happy with it. I especially like this greenery. I mean I'm definitely gonna put that back up come you know after Christmas because I really like how the green pops off the, the all of this here. I really am vibing on that. So anyway, um, I just, of course, I just put the same little file stuff here. We're going to be taking all that down when it comes to Christmas, but I may put up some Christmas garland up in this area. Who knows? You know, you know, we'll do, we'll have fun weather week, but I am just tickled on how this looks. I really want to get this mirror hung up and I think it's the perfect mirror for this area. Hopefully this is the last time I'm going to change this four year up because <laughs> next year, next spring, we're really going to start house hunting so you know hopefully this will stay until then <laughs> all right you all well thank y'all so much for watching so sorry it's kind of a quick kind of a fast video but you know sorry about that but we got loads of video coming um i'm going to right after this we're going to start taking on the fall and halloween down and we're going to be in christmas mode then so but anyway thank y'all so so much um thank y'all for all the love and the comments on my last video I'm going to get to them as quickly as I can. Y'all just warm my heart, and I love y'all so, so much. Y'all are the best. All right, you all. Well, as always, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. And also, if you're new here, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. And for those who have been around since day one, 
that will always have my heart. Alrighty, well, until next time, sending all of my love from my home to yours. Happy decorating. Bye-bye. See y'all really soon. Thank you.